What up, Diecast Gang? Welcome back to another video. It's your boy KG back in the workshop studio. Feeling pretty good, guys. Hope everybody's having a blessed day. Back to the diorama build, guys. Today is pretty much going to be an update on the last video on the 164 scale diorama I'm working on. Actually, guys, it's coming along really well. My business coming into fruition. Love it when the plan comes together, guys. It's looking really, really good. Uh, really don't have a lot of time. I gotta go to work real soon. So, uh, I'm gonna work on it a little bit maybe today before I go to work. But I'm gonna try to come home tonight after I get off work. Because uh, I work second shift, I get off at 11 p.m. So, I'm try to come in tonight, work on it, and record. And, uh, Work on it Sunday, which is tomorrow. Work on it pretty much the majority of the day. So, just gonna show you where I'm at right now, give you an update, and show you what my next plans is and where I'm going from here. Let's check it out. All right, diecast gang, here we are. This is the museum that I'm building, 164 scale. My idea was to build an automotive museum, and in my head, I was thinking um, American cars, American classics, and antiques in the beginning. So I wanted to make it look like sort of like a warehouse that they turned into a museum, and kind of updated it a little bit. That's why I went with like the brick wall in the back, the exposed brick. It's coming along pretty nice, gang. Uh, I got I wanted actually three levels so so far I have the second level pretty much completed I got my hand rails or you know guard rails or whatever you want to call it already in place glued together got the wood trim around like I explained in, in the last video that's pretty much complete on the second level now right here I have the third third level completed, ready to go into place, but I have to to add my supports, my walls, like I did on the first level. I'm gonna build the walls around this area over here on the on the left, just fill that in, and then build another support wall on, on the right. And then I have some wood bales right here that I didn't show you yet. I was explaining to you in the last video. And I'm going to have to add some posts. So there we have it. Actually going to take this and cut it to the length. So guys, you can see I will have a post right there. The exact same height that I needed. The exact same height as this. I'm gonna add a post right here also. And then, like I mentioned, I'm gonna add one in the middle right here. Because my original plan, gang, was to add a wall, a foam board wall in the back, all the way across to support the second and third floor. Like I was just gonna cut a foam board and put it across. That way, it would have been had support all the way across the hole but honestly it doesn't need it guys I mean I think it's pretty strong enough once I put the post here and here also I might add one in the back all the way in the back back there so it can have and you know add like a little piece of small wood between the two posts and just have that support all the way across you know but right now I have my elevator <clears throat> door piece just cut out. I realize I'm going to have to make it wrap all the way around. You know, to give it support for the second, for the third level. This is going to be holding the third level. But then I'm going to get my shape of my door cut out like I got down on the bottom level here. Door is already 
cut out and ready to go. But as soon as I can add the support for the third floor, I can try to get it up in there. Um, I'm not going to have a wall on the second floor, so I'm going to add the dowel. I'm going to have to add some dowels here, two dowels here and here to hold the third floor. If that makes any sense. But I don't have time to work on it in today's video game because I have to go to work. But I just wanted to give you guys an update, show you guys how it's coming along. I'm loving it. Um, right now, I'm just going, before I go to work, I'm going to try to get the plastic put around the third floor for for my handrail. Because I haven't done that yet, but it's other, other than that, the, the wood and the floor, everything else is complete. I just need to put the handrail. And... Then I can build my support and get it in place. My next step from there, guys, is going to be adding the lighting. So I'm real excited about that. I'm hoping that that happens in tomorrow's video. More than likely it would, guys, because I got the whole day tomorrow to get a lot done. So, so if you watch me for the first time and you enjoy the content, you like what you see, please take the time to hit that like button, subscribe. If you're not subscribed already, hit the bell, turn on all post notifications so you won't miss a single video. Every now and then I'll have a gap elapsing between content, so you might want to hit that bell, turn on post notifications on all so you'll get the notification when I drop a video. Um, everything's coming along well, guys. I'm real happy, happy with the results. My, my vision is coming to life. Um... And I got a few more steps, gang. Hopefully, uh, we'll be almost done by tomorrow. I'm hoping I'm keeping my fingers crossed. Because <laughs> tomorrow will be the seventh day. I started this project on Monday, and tomorrow is Sunday. So, till tomorrow's video, guys. Have a blessed day. I'm out.